Hello everyone and welcome to a mod spotlight. Today we are looking at the follow me mod. At the moment of the recording it is in the other section of the mod hub. This is on PC, not sure if it's on console. Uh, so basically this allows you to drive a vehicle and have other vehicles follow automatically uh, without having to play with other real people. So let's go take a look at the controls real quick. Alright, so when you go to your controls, find the follow me section. Basically there's two main sets. There will be the right control. That is if you are in the follow vehicle. And then there's the right shift vehicle which has the same um, controls. It's just that you use right shift when you're in the lead vehicle and I'll show all this in the video coming up. Just wanted to make sure that you do check your controls because they might be different or you may want to change them or if you're on a console they'll be completely different. So let's go look at how to use this in the game. So we're at the shop and let's say I have two vehicles um, or more and I want to get them all back to the farm without having to make separate trips. Uh, with this mod I can just put this behind this guy and then all I have to do is drive the one in front. So I'm going to put the um, follower behind. Now if I'm in the follower I'm going to use right control and you'll see it come up on the controls and then I hit F just to turn it on. So that'll toggle on and off and you can see now the tractor is the leader. Once you're in the lead vehicle instead of using right control you're going to use right shift you can see the follower comes up. Now I need to increase the distance that he follows me um, because of this implement. If I drive forward, he'll follow. And basically whatever path you take, he'll take. Um, maybe. So there he comes. I don't know why sometimes it just kind of waits a little longer, but that's basically it. If I want to increase the distance so he doesn't always hit me, um, I can hold shift and use the W and S keys and that'll put the distance behind and ahead. So I want him to go, uh, let's go 10 behind 15. You'll just have to kind of play with the distances. And there we go. And now he'll kind of stay behind and not hit me when he stops, hopefully. And... There we go. And I can just go all the way back to my farm or wherever I want and he'll keep following me. So if I want to cancel that, I can um, hold shift and hit F. So F is the toggle. And again, check your controls um, for all the, all the options. Let's look at one other use for this. If we go to here, um, this mod allows you then to harvest with a tipper or auger wagon following. So again, I'm behind the lead vehicle. Control F. Um, the distance will have to change. Again, once I get in here, I can change all that. So what I'm going to do first is put the distance at zero. And now the important thing is A and D is going to offset. So I want to offset to the left since that's where my pipe is going to be. And then it really is just going to take um, some finagling and you're just going to have to keep testing it until you get it. And then once you get it, you'll be able to do the field pretty easily. So it looks like the offset is enough. Um, yeah, I don't think he'll, well, maybe half more. And then all I have to do is decrease the follow distance. Let's go um, ahead by five because remember it's going for the tractor not the tipper. So that's five, so let's do 10. And then I should be able to start harvesting. And he should quote unquote follow me with my offset and my ahead distance set so that he's just actually a little bit ahead of me now. So um, that's a couple basic uses for this mod. Again, check your controls, uh, key bindings. Uh, the most important thing is the F button toggles it on and off and then the 
A, uh, the A and D does the offset right and left, and the WS does the ahead and behind distance. So there's a quick look at the follow me mod. Hope that helps. Any questions, please post in the comments below, like and or dislike, depending on your feelings about this video. And of course, have yourselves a very nice day.